because you've been singing like basically since your whole life is there a secret to being like a gospel singer that's is there a secret to it what is it what does it take to be a gospel singer um i would have to say you have to have a love for god um because it has to come it first of all it has to come from the heart you know whatever it is that you're singing it has to come from the heart um it can't be about you it can never be about you um, if you're going to do gospel music it always has to be about it has to be about god we're talking about the gospel right you right. know what i mean so it has to be about god um i remember one of my friends um and he passed now but an amazing singer an amazing singer we had many conversations about um the difference between singing secular music and singing gospel and he would say um um, to me, Armanda, I want what you got. Like I want, I want to be able to do that. And I'm like, well, you, it got to come. It just has to come from the heart. You know, it has to come from the heart. And I'm singing a different kind of music than you are. You know, right. like all of my, the, the, when I sing, when I sing gospel, um, it's about worship. It's about praise. And I'm singing to you, but I'm actually worshiping God mm. in the process of it all. Um, so. So you're not really trying to entertain people. You're like, you're worshiping God yourself, and they're feeling that with your... Exactly. Um, I would say, like, I always I always tell people, like, even before I sing, um, I always pray, and I say, if I know that I have to sing, part of my prayer is, God, use me and anoint me, minister to me and through me, mm. you know, because I don't want to be just singing in vain. You know, it's for his glory, but it's also to minister to somebody else's heart, you know, to encourage them, to uplift them. And if it's not doing that, then it's in vain, you know. Right. And so um, I would say that that's what it would have to be, you know, it would have to be from the heart, mm -hmm. you know, and make sure that you that God is in it. You know, you're not just, you know, I love the runs. I wish I could do them all. <laughs> <laughs> I love the runs. I think they're very pretty. But um I don't think that a lot of times you can put too many runs in a song and it can throw that whole song off mm -hmm. and now they can't even hear the message that you're trying to get across to them. Right. You know what I mean? Mm -hmm. So um, I would say that they would have to have their heart in it and it would have to be about God and not them. Right. 